What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris the Cast Gamer, and welcome to a brand new series here on the channel. I'm so excited to do this. Um, so we are going to be doing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of the Sky, and I'm just going to move ahead here, have a little bit of you know, a little bit of music here in the background. So I love the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon series, but however, this one I have never played. <laughs> a lot of people is probably going to shout at me in the comments saying, of all the games that you didn't play, why didn't you play the best one? <laughs> okay, all right. First, calm down. Second, I, kn I know I missed out on this one. I think... I want to say that when this game, that when this particular game came out was when I was, um, was that transition point in my life where I wasn't actually into Pokemon at all, so I kind of missed this one, and and uh, when Mystery Dungeon came back after this one with um, Gates to Infinity on the 3DS, I was like, you know what, let's play it again, or let's. Let's get back into Mystery Dungeon again, because we're so long since I last played it. And here, and uh, I played Gaze to Infinity, I've played uh, the new one, Super Mystery Dungeon, and yeah. So, I am so excited to be doing Mystery Dungeon, and if you guys are excited as well for Mystery Dungeon being on the channel be sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel because your support is greatly appreciated um now i do know <laughs> here's a i'm giving you guys a disclaimer um with the mystery dungeon series there's a quiz with this quiz there's a particular pokemon that you, that i can be and if i pick it I am not playing the game with it. <laughs> There's a reason for that. Because one of the mods that you can be is Skitty. No word of a lie, you can be Skitty. When I pl when I first played the Mystery Dun um when I I think when I when I did attempt to try, I think it was uh uh Time or Darkness, it was one of them. And I did the quiz, and every single time I finished the quiz, I got Skitty. No word of a lie, and since then I have had a burning hatred for that Pokemon for that for that Pokemon. If I pick Skitty, I am redoing the quiz. If I need to, I will put a Skitty counter on screen if I need to. But I am not. I am not playing the game as Skitty. Just putting that out there. All right. Um, I also have a thing set up here in which I can switch because this is the first time I'm doing a DS game. I have um, I have OBS set up that I, I can change screens. So if you see me changing screens a lot, that's why. Anyway, we're gonna hit new game and do this quiz. All right. Welcome. This is the portal that leads to the world inhabited only by Pokemon. Beyond this gateway, many new adventures and fresh experiences await your arrival. Before you depart for adventure, you must answer some questions. Be truthful when you answer them. Oh, don't worry. I'll be truthful. But the answer, I might not like. Now, are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. Then, let the questions begin. Okay. Did you play Explorers of Time or Explorers of Darkness? Yes, I have, but I never finished. So, I'm gonna say no. Have you ever blurted something out without blurted something out without thinking about the consequences? Um, it has happened, but it doesn't normally happen, so unfortunately, I'm gonna hit yes. Everyone sharing a dessert and there's an extra piece. What do you do? Um Everyone's sharing a dessert, and there's an extra piece. What do I do? I mean, I'm gonna—I'm not gonna lie here. I am not a dick, okay? I'm not an asshole or anything like that. But 
one of my major downfalls is sweets. First, um, first come, first serve. Do you want to be taller someday? Yes. <laughs> because I'm short. Your friend is running a little late to meet you. Is that okay? Yes, that's fine. You discover a beat up looking treasure chest in some ruins. What do you do? Um, open it. Your friend takes a spectacular fall. What do you do? I'll help him up and then laugh. <laughs> What's your studying style? Um, my studying style? Um, working hard every day. You're eating a very fancy restaurant. You're eating at a very fancy restaurant. Uh, which course do you select? Um, I wish, kind of wish they had burgers, but it's because burgers is what I usually go for, but I'll go anything. It's all good. Am I male or female? I am male. All right. <laughs> Your aura will now be analyzed. Your aura is the energy that you radiate. Relax, calm yourself, and press your fingertip gently on the bow. Okay. And now exhale. All right. Your aura has now been identified. Lift your finger. Your aura is... A clear aqua blue. Alright. Thank you for answering all those questions. You seem to be the brave type. Okay. You don't know the meaning of fear. You do, you're do. you not afraid to mo keep moving forward in the face of danger. You also have a strong sense of justice and can't turn a blind eye to someone in trouble. But you can sometimes push your own personal sense of justice a little too hard. Be careful that you don't get too pushy. Uh, it's not quite like me, but we'll, we'll we'll keep going. So a brave type like you is wow. <laughs> Can't say I was expecting that. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm a Pikachu. <laughs> I was kind of hoping for a grass type, but okay. I guess I'll be I'll guess I guess I'll be the mascot of the entire friggin' franchise. Finally, who will be your partner? Choose a Pokemon you want. Fuck you. Uh... Who do I want? I was hoping it was gonna be a Trico, because that's my favorite mod. Um, there isn't really anyone here who... Um... I guess Vampy? I kind of want to say Fampy. Either Fampy or Riolu. Hmm. Actually, you know what? I think the... I think having a Riolu as my partner might actually be pretty cool. I'm going to pick Riolu. Oh, what do I want to name him? What do I want to name a Riolu? Um... What's a good name for a Riolu? Mm. God, I want to go Steven for whatever reason, but I don't remember seeing if he was male or female. I think he was male. <laughs> Let's call him Steven. <laughs> I don't know why, but Steven. Uh, no, let's not. Let's not do Steven. <laughs> um, do I want to use my typical naming convention when naming Pokemon? Let's... Uh, actually, you know what? Let's keep, let's keep, let's keep it Steven. <laughs> let's keep it Steven. Bring it. Let's do it. Okay, that's it. You're all ready to go. You're off to the world of Pokemon. Be strong, stay smart, and be victorious. All right. 
Chapter 1, Storm at Sea. Whoa! Are, are you okay? No, don't let go. Just a little longer. Come on, hang on. No, no, I can't. Hold on. Wow! <laughs> oh, man. I'm, I'm so excited to be playing this game, guys. And I get to make so many voices for different for different Pokemon. This is going to be great. <laughs> Test my vocal range, I guess. Da -da 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 Ugh. Where? Where am I? It's so weird seeing me as a Pikachu, I'm not gonna lie! I can't. Drifting off. And then we fall back to sleep again. Or pass out. Alright. Um. Let's see. Kind of a voice for Steven. Hmm. Oh god, no. Not that. No. I refuse by to be paralyzed by this any longer. No. That's more like me. Hold on. Damn, I can't think of a voice for Steven! <laughs> this is it. I have to steal my courage today. Oh my god, no. Can we not make him Russian? <laughs> Pokemon detected! Pokemon detected! Who's Footprint? Who's Footprint? Footprint is Riolus! Footprint is Riolus! Ah! Uh, my god, I need to think of a voice. Oh my god, why am I blank? Why am I blanking here? <sighs> that was too shocking. There we go. Phew. I can't. I can't work up the courage to go in after all. I told myself that this is the day, but... I thought that holding on to my personal treasure would inspire me. Uh, I just can't do it. I'm such a coward. This is so discouraging. That works. <laughs> All right. Now we got these guys. I know perfect voice for these guys. Hey Zubat, did you get a load of that? You bet I did coughing. The little wimp that was pacing around had something good tonight. That wimp had something, that's for sure. It looked like some kind of treasure. Do we go after it? We do. There we go. Especially Zubat. I knew exactly what I wanted to do for Zubat. Mm. Damn you, glass. It's splashing water on me. <laughs> so I know this video might not get uh, much a action because this beginning part, especially with the quiz, kind of does take a little bit to do. Oh, wow. What a pretty sight. Oh, my God. Did I change his voice again? <laughs> I think I changed his voice again. I do like the music in this game, though. When the weather when the weather is good, the crabby come out at sundown to blow bubbles. All those bubbles catching the sun's rays right off the waves. It's always beautiful. <laughs> this is where I always come. When I'm feeling sorry for myself. But it makes me feel good to be here, like always. Coming here is uplifting. It cheers me up. Hey, what's that? What's going on over there? And insert me. Wah! Someone has collapsed on the sand. What happened? Are you okay? Ugh. 
You're awake. That's a relief. Where... Where am I? You were moving at all. I was seriously worried. Do you remember how you ended up unconscious out here? I... I was unconscious? What happened? Well, I'm Steven. Glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around before. What? You say you're a human. You look like a totally normal Pikachu to me. Checks myself. Realize that I got three fingers... Three little stubby fingers for, for hands, and I got a tail, and almost no no legs. Basically, non-existent legs. And, you know, a massive lightning bolt of a tail. Yeah, standard stuff. It's true. I've turned into a Pikachu. But how did this happen? I don't remember anything. You're a little odd. Are you pulling some kind of trick on me? You're telling me the truth? All right, then. Your name? What's your name? My name? That's right. My name is, uh, duh, it's Chris. <laughs> like, the duh. Oh, Chris is your name. Okay. Well, you don't seem to be a bad Pokemon, at least. Sorry that I doubted you. More and more bad Pokemon have been turning up lately, you see. Many Pokemon have gotten aggressive lately. Things have grown somewhat lawless. Well, I do beg your pardon. Hey, why'd you do that? <laughs> can't figure it out. We wanted to mess with you. Can't, can't face up to us, can you? What? That's yours, ain't it? No, that's... Sorry, kiddo. We'll take it. Wow. Ah. Alright. I'm not gonna do those. The eyes are the... Whoa. Not gonna make a move to get it back? What's the matter? Too scared? I didn't expect you to be such a big coward. Come on, let's get out of here. See you around, chicken. <laughs> and now we gotta get it back. Oh. What should I do? That, that was my personal treasure. It means everything to me. If I lose that, we gotta get it. There's no time to waste. I gotta get it back. Oh my god, why am I... <clears throat> the answer is gonna be yes, obviously. Really? You you really help? Thank you. Let's go quickly. Okay, that's the better voice for Steven. <laughs> Alright. Head for the stairway. I know how to fly. Oh, okay. I do have it perfect there. Cool. Alright. Let's do... That. Um... You said move. Oh, shit. Oh. I thought I had the move set, but I guess I don't. <sighs> I probably, I, I guess I probably don't have a move set yet because where this is literally just the tutorial. Come on, there we go. Yes, I know. This is the world's money. Um, what's the menu X? Do I have any? I do have moves. Oh yes. I want to set Thunder Shock. Uh, what about... What about Steven? Okay, he got all of those set. Um... Let's... Let's... So the way that I normally play Mystery Dungeon games is that I usually go around to every part of the... Uh, every part of the map. So that I can pick up all the, so I can pick up like all the items and stuff. Oh, oh. round button. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to use Thunder Shock here. I'm just going to use regular attacks. All right. Uh, na 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 na. I'm definitely not using Thunder Shock here. Definitely not. All right. Shallows is down. Eight experience. Ah, uh, you s dummy. All right. Beach cave, floor two. You can carry one item. The items you find on the floor are very useful effects. If you find an item, open the menu with X. That's fine. Hornberry restores HP.
<laughs> Come on. Endure? Really? Of all the moves you could have picked, you picked Endure. Uh, there it is. Oh, I keep hitting the wrong button. I went to use Thunder thunder Shock there. And you're asleep. Alright. Is there any... Okay, there's another ore. There's a stairs. Oh, really? Okay. <clears throat> For those of you who've never played a mystery dungeon game before, uh, every every dungeon uh, is randomized. So even though I'm taking this particular path, it doesn't mean that you're gonna get it when um, when you play it, or if you're if you just if you guys decide to play along. In some new areas, you will see a ground tile with a green arrow. It's a wonder tile. It'll heal. Just, it'll yeah. It'll heal you. Stat changes, like attack, evasion, accuracy, the like. Alright, what else? There's the stairs. Uh, yeah. You Sunder Shock on you. Ooh, I leveled up! Three, two, two, two. Not bad. And Steven, too! Ooh! You want to learn counter. Ooh. Uh, let's get rid of foresight. Oh shit. Yes. Why is the default option no? I hate it when the default option is no. It's like, I get what they're trying to do. Oh jeez. Oh, I got static. Okay. Oh, really? We're just missing for days. Okay, apparently we're just missing. Uh, it says we can only have one item right now, but I believe we will get a bag anyway. So that we can carry more, but right now we are only stuck to just the one, unfortunately. Where did that... Where did, the, where did you come from? That's fine. Use Harden. Waste a turn. That's perfectly fine by me. Oh, great. Shallows is here. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's nothing there. Damn. Alright. <sighs> Just die already. I want to get this dungeon finished. Come on. Have a question about anything? You can blah 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 and hit the hints option. Keep the Ornberry at least, in case I need to. For the, uh, at the end of every stage that you do in the main game, there is a uh, bossy fight. So obviously we're gonna be fighting Coughing and Zubat. So I'm gonna save my Ornberry for that. Okay, nothing over there. Alright, I guess we're moving on. Oh, we're at the end. Okay, cool. I'll take it. Uh, hey! Oh, there we go. Well, well. If it isn't our old friend, the old big chicken. Mm. Give me, give me back what you stole from me. That's my personal treasure. It means everything to me. Treasure, you say? So that the thing is really valuable, huh? It could be worth more than we hoped for, I'd say. Oh my god. Why am I changing voices all around? We ought to try selling it. Who knows? It might get a good price. Whoa ho ho ho. All the more reason not to give it back. What? If you want it back that badly, come and get it. <laughs> and now we fight. Even though this is going to be easy as hell. Uh, shit. There we go. Zubat's done. Uh, how much HP? Oh, geez, Steven's almost dead. There we go. 
Ooh, counter. There we go. Oh, okay. Steven did that whole fight. Or the uh, coughing, at least. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. Ugh, we got wrapped up. The blast it. How do we get wiped out by wimps like them? Bah, here you go. Take it then. Whoa, don't you think you're awesome? Don't you think you don't think you're so awesome your victory was a fit Vic victory? Victory. Yeah, you just remember that. So you say. Oh, that's my relic fragment. Am I ever glad? I actually did manage to get it back. It's only because you agreed to help me, Chris. Thank you. Alright. Thank you, seriously. I only held because I wanted to be there. Was it the right thing to do? I guess so. This Pokemon's clearly grateful. It's, so, it's nice to be appreciated. <laughs> Here's what they stole. It's a, This is a relic fragment. Well, at least that's what I started calling it. But this relic fragment is my precious treasure. You see, I've always liked legends and lore. I always get so excited when I hear tales from the past. Hilarious, because this is... Oh, I know, this isn't time. This is Sky. <laughs> Don't you feel the same way? Hidden troves full of treasure and strange relics. Uncharted territories veiled in darkness. And new lands just waiting to be explored. Such places must be full of unimaginable unimaginable gold and treasure. And history! Wouldn't it be amazing to make historic discoveries? That's what I always dream of. It's all exciting to me. So one day, I happen to come across my relic fragment. I admit that it looks like junk, but take a closer look. See? That inscription forms a strange pattern, doesn't it? It's true. There, there is a strange inscription. I've never seen a pattern like this. There must be some significance to this pattern. This relic fragment must be the key to legendary places, to areas where precious treasure lies. At least, that's the feeling I get. That's why I want to join an expedition exploration team. This fragment must fit into something somewhere. I want to discover where that is. I want to solve the mystery of my relic fragment. So earlier, I tried joining an exploration team as an apprentice, but I chickened out. What about you? What do you want to do? You lost memory and somehow transformed into a Pokemon. You don't you have do you have anywhere to go to stay and stay after this? If not, can I ask a big favor? Will you be willing to form an exploration team with me? I'm convinced that I can form an, an effective exploration team with you. So will you? Please? Whoa, what should I do? I'm getting recruited right out of the blue. I don't know what an exploration team is. What should I do? Should I join this Pokemon and form an exploration team? Yes, we'll do it. It's true, I do have nowhere to go, and I don't have any clue where to go. What should I do next? I guess it wouldn't hurt to team up with Stephen for now. Maybe I'll eventually discover who or what I am by hanging out with him. Okay, that's settled. Yeah, we'll do it. Yes, really? You'll form an exploration team- Oh my god, that high pitch was at the end there. You'll form an exploration team with me? Yes, thank you! We're gonna be great! We're gonna be a great combination! Let's make this work! First, we should head to Wigglytuff's place and sign up as apprentices. That's where we need to train to become a first-rate exploration team! I'm sure the training will be very tough, but let's give it our best! Yeah! Okay. <laughs> I'll do this first. And so, Steven and Chris formed an exploration team. This turned out to be their very first step into many fantastic realms of adventure that awaited their arrival. I'm excited for this. <laughs> it's crazy. Would you like to save your adventure? I'm going to, and I'm also going to leave the video off there. We're about half a, we're about half an hour in, so I kind of want to don't want to leave it any longer than that unless I absolutely need to. So if you guys have stuck around this long, thank you guys oh so much for for uh for supporting the series. If you haven't already, be sure to click that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel because your support is greatly greatly appreciated i'm excited to be doing this game i'm not gonna lie 
uh, the channel was oversaturated with with Pokemon Snakewood and the game. And like I said in my update video last time, uh, the, the game was just becoming less and less fun and all that stuff. But I'm glad to be doing not a ROM hack anymore, but an actual spinoff game. And I'm really, really excited to be doing this game. So if you guys enjoyed the video, like I said, show the video some love by hitting the thumbs up button and subscribing to the channel because your support is greatly appreciated and all that good, wonderful stuff. Um, the upload schedule for this, I'm hoping for Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, just like Snakewood was. Um, I'm hoping to not have it going on as long as before. So, um, so yeah, like I said, thank you guys for starting this journey with me and hopefully we'll be, hopefully you'll be ending it with me. So with that said, guys, I'm going to get out of here. If, um, like I said, all that stuff before. Uh, I'm excited. I, I, I keep saying I'm excited. It's because it's true. I'm excited to be doing this game. Uh, and yeah. Anyway, I'm going to, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you, Mike, guys, so much for watching. I've been Chris, the Cast Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.